So I'm Naomi Graham Pierre. I'm 21 years old. I was born in Montreal, Canada to Haitian parents and we immigrated to the United States in 1998. Competing in the Olympics for Haiti has really been a life-changing experience and opportunity. I would have never guessed that this was going to be real and going to happen to me, but it's been incredible because I've been able to use this new platform that I have to really show my passions to the world um, and, and really be the change that I want to see in the world, as cliche as that sounds, like I'm really trying to, to be that person. So first of all, in swimming, growing up in the United States, swimming is always um, a platform that you're trying to diversify. So that's always um, something that I was trying to do. So by bringing swimming to Haiti, not only are we diversifying the sport, but we're also bringing like a life skill that every human being should know how to do. <laughs> Bringing swimming to Haiti was um, a huge thing that I was able to accomplish by competing in the Olympics. Um, raising awareness for the drowning problem that we have in Haiti is also um, a huge takeaway that I was able to get from my platform. Another thing is most people when they think about Haiti it's always like from a negative and very ignorant background and that really makes me upset as a Haitian who's had to navigate the world in America and, and we see how it is that people treat Haitians. <laughs> So with my platform, every time I go back to Haiti, I'm trying to showcase the beauty that we have as a country, as a nation, as an island. And let people know that we have a history that's worth sharing and we have, we have a reason to be pr prideful and that's something that I'm really trying to showcase. Um, so for me, it's an honor and a privilege to get to rub the Haitian flag in a sport that I love and really I don't know, create change and, and be a positive source of influence through the platform that I've been blessed to receive through my accomplishments. We have to work together and we have to support each other. Like, as a Haitian, we know, like, it's on our flag, l'union fait la force. And that is a really a powerful statement because if you know our history, if you know where we come from, like it is only through l'union that we were able to accomplish and be big things and be the nation that we are. So I can't even imagine what God has in store for the next two years as we prepare for the 2020 Olympics. And if everything continues with love and with support and with unity because that is the most important thing that we can we can really use to accomplish these great tasks 2028 we're going to be unstoppable like i'm scared to see what's going to happen <laughs>